I'd like to report a crime that hasn't happened yet. Have you seen the movie Back to the Future? Basically, I'm living that movie right now, which is how I know there's gonna be a murder tonight. <laughs> Hate time travel movies. They never make any sense. Totally Killer is the latest release from Prime Video and Blumhouse, starring Kiernan Shipka, Olivia Holt, and Julie Bowen. And of course, so many more. Director Nanachka Khan sat with What's Trending to discuss all that went into making the production truly possible. Happy Halloween. How about we all stay in and hand out Halloween candy? No, Mom. You know how hard this time of year is for us. Your friends were murdered 35 years ago. It's not 1987 anymore. Totally Killer has audiences more than excited for spooky season this year, and of course, movies like this from Blumhouse. Khan, who directed the movie, gave what's trending an inside look on the project and how it truly came about. It's Anne reporting. Khan, an American television writer and producer, created and executive produced the ABC comedy Fresh Off the Boat and the NBC comedy series Young Rock. The director spoke about her experience working on comedies, including her latest Netflix film Always Be My Maybe, and how it contributed to bringing a comedic tone to this movie. I want to get into this. Obviously, you've had a lot of titles you've worked on. You have so much to your roster of just comedy experience and more, but how did this project come about? It really was, you know, after the last movie I directed, did, which was a rom-com, Always Be My Maybe. I met with Jason Blum and the team at Blumhouse because I've been a horror fan, but I've never obviously done anything in that space. And so we were just like, this would be so fun. Let's figure out something. And, you know, years later, they sent me the script for Totally Killer. And once I started reading it, I was just like, I'm in. Back to the Future with a serial killer? Like, yes. Thousand percent. Staying true to the time period of this film, Khan even took inspiration from horror movies of the 1980s. The director noted that she went back to some classics of the genre, including Halloween and Friday the 13th. Khan even admits that the Scream franchise served as a great touchstone for comedic relief and inspiration for Totally Killer. <laughs> what the? <laughs> Excuse me. What year is it? 1987. Oh my God. I know. The 80s are almost over and I haven't even tried Coke yet. <laughs> I don't know. Now, aside from the inspiration of the film, Khan admits that working with the cast was an absolute pleasure. Obviously, you worked with a stellar cast here. You have Kiernan Shipka, you have Olivia Holt, Julie Bowen. What was it like just working with this group of, of people together for Totally Killer? It was fantastic. Like, starting with Kiernan, like, she was the first piece of the puzzle as Jamie, the lead, because there's so much required of that character, you know, that she's got to be able to play the comedy and the tension and the terror, but she's got this big emotional trauma that's driving her throughout this movie. So she's got to keep that element of like the wounded animal going a little bit. And she's such a professional. I mean, she's a legend at 22. Like, I don't understand how that's possible, but she's been working and doing it for so long that she comes in like fully prepared, but also like, super open to like working together and just like collaborating and finding stuff in the moment. Um, Olivia Holt, I mean, she's incredible. The two of them together were so funny. Olivia has a great way of playing like the mean girl, but in a funny way. And, uh, and Julie, just, I mean, Julie and Olivia playing the same character to me was just like, this is perfect, uh, I loved it. And of course, Khan has nothing but great things to say about her experience working with Blumhouse. The production company, known for titles like Ma, The Black Phone, and even Get Out, worked closely with the director on this film and has been catching the attention of audiences for quite some time. They're such a filmmaker-friendly studio. I mean, they want to make movies and they love movies. And I think that to me was really exciting. Like sometimes, you know, you'll be working at a studio or a place where you feel like, does anybody really want to make this thing? Or is are we just going to develop this forever? Like, you know, you're kind of like dragging them into making something. And Blumhouse is the other way around. Like, they're so passionate. And they're like, let's go make something. Let's go make a, a movie that we're all excited about. And of course, you can catch Totally Killer on Prime Video starting October 6th.